It's that time of the year again. Omaha citizens are eager to find a new leader. Five men are in the fight to be Omaha's 50th mayor. Jim Suttle, Democrat, is a former chairman of the board of directors for the engineering firm HDR. He feels he is the most qualified. I'm an engineer. I'm trained to solve problems. And I have been taught to identify what the problem is today, set the outcomes that you want to ascribe to, and figure out the strategies and the path on how to get there. When asked what issues he felt were the most important, he said he had been building his thoughts off of what the citizens have been thinking. Number one, the crime and gun violence, followed by close number two, which is the pension plans, uh, particularly the spiking issue. And coming up very, very quickly is number three, the concern with the economy and so forth about how we're going to pay for this federal mandate on sewer separation, which is, has a price tag of $1.5 billion. With 30 years of experience, Suttle said he can create a strategy to help budget for the two biggest financial challenges, the Rosenblatt Stadium and on the federal mandate on sewer separation. When asked why he should be voted for mayor... I'm going to ask for the job. I was trained to do that at HDR. Ask for the job. When addressing his specific goals, Suttle said the next mayor must fight to make sure the city is not left behind in national efforts to stimulate the economy. For the Omaha News, I'm Amy Pfeiffer.